Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, as you can see from the title, it is another hair review video sponsored by The Best Love Me Hair. If you're new here, hey, my name is Akira Janae. Don't forget to subscribe and join the family before you leave. So I just wanted to hop on and show you guys the hair first. And then if you want to see how I achieved this look in less than five minutes, yes, five minutes, then keep on watching. The wig took about three to four days to get to me. As you can see, the wig did come DHL, so normally shipping does not take long with them for me where I'm at. I am in Arkansas, so normally shipping is about three to four days. This is their box. Super cute. When you open the box, you're going to get your wig, of course. You get a set of two wig caps. And then this is something new. I've never received this from Love Me before. It was like a cute little bitty um, mirror. And then, of course, you get earrings the edge brush and then a little um wrap to tie down your baby hairs but this was super cute i've never seen anyone get like a little mirror from love me so i really thought that was super cute um it's a little mirror on the go and it kind of fits like a um credit card in your wallet so this is the wig i have it is a glueless five by five closure it does have two combs on the side one comb in the back and then it also came with an elastic band on the back side of it um it wasn't pre-plucked, I don't believe. Um, there was a little bit of tint to it on the lace, but you'll see that I am about to use lace tint. The lace tint does come in about four to five different shades, so you can use whichever shade that fits best for your skin tone. After letting the um, lace tint sit on there for about five to 10 minutes, I do go back in and then I will start plucking after the lace tint is completely dry. If you're crunched for time, you could use a blow dryer to get the lace dry. Since this is a curly wig, there's not much hot combing to do. All I do is hot comb the closure part just to get it as flat as possible. And I do this so that I can go in and pluck. Um, I don't really like to pluck with wet hair. I like to pluck with dry hair. So that's what I'm going to do. Just kind of perfecting the part a little bit. I am obviously going to do a middle part. So after that, I'm going to use the edge wax. Lay that down. And then I'm going to go in with the hot comb again to get it flat. And then we're going to start plucking. The method I like to do when plucking is kind of pluck, pluck, skip, pluck, pluck, skip, pluck, pluck, skip. Um, as you can see, that's what I'm doing. And it's just the easiest plucking method for me. Um, I learned it here on YouTube and I just find that it works fastest and the easiest, especially for a beginner and especially for a closure. It's super simple, super easy. Just make sure you don't plug too much in the same spot or else you're gonna have like a bald spot in since we don't want that. Right here, I want to show you a close-up. This is me plucking for about two to three minutes. Um, it looks so much better. So this is the side I plucked, and this is the side that has not been plucked yet. You can see a tremendous difference, and this side looks really good. And then I'm just going to go ahead and try to mimic it on the other side. The other side, I can't really pluck as good as my um, right side just because, you know, I'm obviously not left-handed, so that's always a challenge for me, but this is how it looks close up. Super cute, blending in, looking just like skin. And I like to always go in with a razor to cut the lace. The razor just gives a more natural jagged cut rather than doing scissors straight across. And 
and after getting the lace completely cut you can see that it literally looks just like scalp and there's no glue on it at all and right here i was happy because baby it's giving scalp without it even being glued down so here's the glue test there's absolutely no glue on here it's glueless and it's literally looking like scalp And then I'm just going in with a little bit of powder foundation to put on the lace so it can blend in a little bit better. And then I'm using just water to make the curls pop. As you already saw this is the finished product the only thing that i put on the hair was water and then i used um, a foaming like wrap lotion i like to use wrap lotions rather than like eco styler gel or any type of gel because the um excuse me the foaming wrap lotion is less harsh um and like the eco styler gel isn't harsh like it's meant to be with water it's water based it's just it starts getting a little crunchy and curls like this i like for them to still be flowy and really bouncy so that's why i like to just use a foam and grab lotion <laughs> but yeah super cute and i did not glue this down i already did the little glue test with the comb but here's a closer look let me scoop down so this is how the hairline looks. I just did a little bit of plugging just because I didn't want to over pluck. Since this is a closure, I don't recommend plucking too much because if you are going to rewear this a lot, um, it's going to start to bald. So I definitely do not want this balding, but literally this is no glue. I'll pull it up a little bit. No glue, isn't glued down, super cute, blends in perfectly. And I have the elastic band on. If you saw earlier in the video, the elastic band is optional. I think you should wear the elastic band if you are trying to do a glueless method just because it does keep your wig secure and tight so i absolutely love that you guys saw that it came dhl it was two day shipping this time shipping was super fast um this is how the box looks I already did an overview of that all the goodies um one goodie that i wanted to point out again if i didn't already talk about it is this this is so cute i've never seen a company um have like a little mirror it has their logo love me and look it's a freaking mirror so baby you need to look at that lace real quick make sure it's laying down as flat as possible this is super cute but yeah it's just the mirror so you can see my setup right there and it comes in kind of like a little like debit card so it's really easy to put into your purse i thought that was super cute this hair super cute super flowy i don't have anything to complain about you guys know i love love me hair this hair easy five minutes five minutes and you're done cutting the lace i spray lace tint everything is fine so yeah this hair is definitely a 10 out of 10 it is the easiest one of the easiest wigs i've ever installed for sure literally doesn't need anything this is definitely a beginner lace wig it is a 5x5 hd closure i believe they sent me either 22 or 24 inches but honey it's it's just so cute like get into it <laughs> so yeah as always don't forget to like this video comment and subscribe and until my next video i will see you lovelies then bye guys